for boaters tonight about keeping our waters clean. Good evening and thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Sarah Swistak. We've all heard about zebra mussels. They've been around for years, but boats are continuing to spread them around our lakes. Now area parks are urging boaters to follow a law that some may not even know about. Reporter Ann Emmerich explains. A visual reminder of a pest found in most Michigan lakes. Lifeguards at Lake Lansing discovered this pair of sunglasses covered with zebra mussels. I assume the sunglasses probably in the lake only maybe a year, but there is zebra mussels in Lake Lansing and it's uh, invasive that we're trying to control by one, one means or another. There's no way to get rid of the zebra mussel completely, but it can be controlled if boaters cooperate by simply keeping their vessels clean. How much are boaters aware of the fact that you need to clean your boat off? Probably not as much as they should be. It certainly is the law. Um, you're not supposed to launch any kind of craft into uh, waters of Michigan with any kind of plants attached. It should all be clean and, and ready to go before you go out into the waters. Um, but that doesn't mean that there's going to be a policeman at every boat launch making sure that people are doing that. Experts say boats are the the number one way invasive species are spread. Most lakes offer cleaning stations where boaters can rid their vessel of debris and live materials. And for the first time, the state has partnered with MSU with a mobile washing unit. We have a trailer mounted boat washing system that we're taking all over the state this summer to help boaters get their boats clean, learn about invasive species, and the simple steps they can do. Simple but important steps to keep the lakes healthy for years to come. It certainly is an honor system and kind of a, a good Samaritan kind of thing. To do. In Hazlitt, Ann Emmerich, Fox 47 News. At Lake Lansing, managers are asking people to simply inspect their boats before they hit the water. If you can't wash them, just go around and remove any plants or zebra mussels with your hands. They say it's also important to throw out any live bait that you haven't used.